Hey guys, so this is going to be a really exciting haul for you today. It is going to be on a new straightener and a new lipstick. Now, I have showed you guys my straightener before, and it's just the Chi, and it's green, and it's really loud, and I've had this. It was really dirty. Um, I've had this for like a little over, no, maybe like a year and a half, probably almost two years, and I love it. It does everything that I want it to. I have no complaints about it at all, but the one thing that is always bugged me like since the week after I got it was the color and I know that's so minute to go buy another strainer but um, I'm still going to use my Chi like it's not like I'm not going to use it but um, I did purchase a different straightener that I'm really excited about um, I did my hair with it today my curly hair so it pretty much does the same thing as my Chi does and it's really for like a fourth of the price so I picked this up today I went I was really, really upset earlier, so I did a little shopping spree, a little me time, and I purchased this from Marshalls. This is a Cortex Platinum Black Series Tourmaline Straightening Iron, and I got it for $30. It just looks like that. Okay. And this is a professional brand straightener. Now, this one is an inch and a quarter for the um, width of the plates. And I really love, it's just a very sleekly designed box. It just pops open and the straightener lays in there. But obviously I took it out because I've used it already. And the straightener itself just looks like this. It's a Cortex. And if you guys are um, familiar with the Revlon um, Color Burst, I think the Color Burst um, lipsticks, how they have that, um, that etching on it. Like the pattern, that's pretty much what it looks like around the whole thing. This is Cortex um, at the tip. And this is the inside. You guys can see that. And it's on and off. And this goes up to 450 degrees, which is another reason why I got it. Because my cheese straightener, you turn it on and that's it. You don't know how high it goes up to, which is kind of aggravating. And you can't adjust it for if you don't want to crazy like fry your hair. So... That's another reason why I purchased this um, straightener, and I'm very happy with it. I used it today, and I'm really excited about it. So that's um, the Cortex Tourmaline. I believe it's a tourmaline. And this is um, an international brand, and also this has a lifetime warranty on it. It has 100% solid ceramic plates, but what got me was the lifetime warranty because the same thing is how cheese straighteners are. As long as you keep the receipt and the original box and you send it back, They'll send you a brand new straightener because you purchased it and you didn't do anything to it. It just stopped working. So definitely excited about this purchase. And I'm so excited that it's a fourth of the price of a cheat and it works exactly the same way. So on a side note, I love Starburst and I always buy like the little packages when I see them. So I bought these in Walmart today. These are like the huge bag of Starburst, but these are like the fave reds. So there's just like the, the fruit punch and the cherry and the strawberry. I'm really excited to eat these. <laughs> i just let you guys know that. Um, okay, next thing that I'm really, really excited about. Um, I Every time I log on to YouTube and I look through the videos, they're all about where can I get the greatest nude lipstick or, oh my God, I found the best nude combination. And they're all the ones that I'd have to order online or that don't exist anymore or... It's just, it's insane. So I've been on the hunt for the past like two weeks for a really great nude lipstick. And I was going to order one, some from e.l.f., like their um, natural nymph. But that one is just too on the white nude side. And it really, it looks like a concealer stick and it like completely nudes out your lips. Um, which is what it's supposed to do, but that one's a little bit too much for me. So what I have on my lips today is my new favorite lip combination like you guys don't even understand I don't wear lipstick I don't wear lip gloss I don't wear anything I do wear chapstick so for me to find a lip gloss and a lipstick that go hand in hand that I love is so crazy but I abs I'm so excited about it so okay so I'm gonna go into I bought these two lipsticks today because I wanted to just buy a couple and just try them out and see if they would work and this one is the Revlon no, this is the Maybelline 
color sensational in 735 champagne shimmer and it just looks like this it's a really pretty color and this is pretty close to like a nude as well but it's like a bronzy nude and I really like this one I've tried this one on as well so this was definitely a plus for me so and it comes in really cute packaging it's like that and um, 735 okay another one that I purchased which was really totally random but I really wanted to get it um, I was looking in the makeup aisle in Walmart and Wet n Wild was having a sale which I feel like they always have sales but I also feel like a lot of their stuff is always um, on the cheaper side. So what I did was I, their um, lipsticks were 93 cents. Who can beat that? So I purchased this one, which is 547B. And I don't think it actually said the color on the packaging. But yeah, 547B and the shade just looks like this. Very, very neutral. Really pretty. Okay. So, and I feel like a lot of these lipsticks look exactly like um, MAC lipsticks, like Shy Girl and Freckle Tone, so, so those two lipsticks. Now, my absolute love that I'm wearing on my lips, I'm going to be purchasing a lot of late, um, in the future, um, is this Revlon lipstick. Now, I've never bought Revlon lipsticks before, and this one is 001, and it's a matte lipstick, so it's really different. It's matte and it's called Nude Attitude and you have to find like the best way to make it matte because if you make it too matte, it'll just dry out your lips. So this is the color, beautiful, beautiful matte nude color. And that's what I have on my lips right now and I literally went out to the car and tried them all on and I was like, I need the other one of this. So I went back into Walmart and got a spare. So that's going to go in my spare drawer, but I definitely went back. And before I went back to Walmart, I went to Target because I didn't want to like walk back in there because I thought it was going to be weird. And Target had none. Like all of their light colors were gone. They had bright reds. I was like, okay. And I knew there was one more left in Walmart. So I cleared out Walmart of their nude attitude, which I'm really excited about. Anytime I see it, I'm just going to pick it up because it is a great color. And to top it, which makes it nice and glossy, which it was glossy before, uh, I just wanted a little bit more shimmer to it. Um, this I found in um, I found it in Target, but um, Dulce Candy eighty seven raves about these, and they're the Elf Luscious Lip ones. And the color I got was in Baby Lips, and that's kind of just like the shade of it. It's like a really, it's like a pinky kind of color. And the applicator just looks like this. So when you crank it, it kind of gets, the product comes through the sponge. And I am in absolute love with this. Like, these will be like in my sweatshirt pocket because that's how much I love them. And I am just so excited that I find a new color. So if you guys are looking for a nude lipstick, a matte nude lipstick, and you want a good taco, and this was a dollar. Like, this together was probably $6, 6 or $7. So, and they're going to last you. So, I mean, I would definitely pick these up. Perfect lip combination if you're looking for a nude lip, especially for me because I don't look good in reds in the winter. And nudes are just, they're so beautiful. They And nudes are in right now. So, I got my nude lips. I got my nude nails. And I'm on the hunt, actually, for a pair of nude heels. So, if you guys know where I can get those, let me know. But I think that's it for this video. I actually think my batteries are going to die, too. So, um yeah if you guys have any questions comments um message me if anything but bye guys